Global Eye by Centelix is a powerful tool enabling you to monitor global media, extract events, and automatically generate visualizations and reports. Let's take a look at Global Eye in action. I have an ongoing task monitoring social media, specifically Telegram channels for mentions of locations in my area of interest. We can see the Telegram channels I've selected to be monitored in the configurations, where I can easily add other channels or social media platforms to monitor. This morning, I received an email alert from Globaleye about mentions of a location in an area of interest. I'll quickly review these in Globaleye to view the Telegram post where this was mentioned. We can see that Novo Mikhailivka was mentioned in this Telegram post talking about it being encircled. This small village southwest of Donetsk could become an area of activity over the next few days and could cause changes in the planned course of action. I'll set up a task within Globaleye to focus on high conflict events in Ukraine. We'll select the country of interest, the data sources we'll monitor and harvest, and the event types of interest, in this case, high conflict events. We'll also set up the rate at which Globaleye will harvest new data. I'll also set up an alert for this task, so that I'm alerted when Novo Mikhailivka is mentioned in new articles or social media posts. Let's now start the task. Almost immediately, global news media is being harvested and processed within Globaleye, extracting key information and connections within the data. Some time later I receive an alert. We can explore the network to find out more. The event network table shows details about extracted events, including the associated entities. Let's look for the location in the location network table. We can see all the articles where this location was mentioned. Going to this article, we can see the location and other entities such as military personnel. This article shows the event of Mortifier, it looks like Russian troops fired artillery at Nova Mihalivka and advanced 200 meters. Let's view the locations from this article on a map. Zooming in, we can see where Nova Mihalivka is located in relation to Donetsk. We can add this event to a network graph to visualize the information. Expanding this network out will give me a clearer picture of the events taking place. I can view events and associated entities in a timeline. For example, I'll add Olenivka. By only showing linked nodes, I can clearly see the events related to Olenivka. Here we have an event earlier on in the timeline talking about HIMARS being used. Later on, there is an event about soldiers being killed. We can also find out more information about the events via the custom reports. This report is broken down into a number of sections. Here I can view the event details, the documents mentioning the event, linking to both online and in Centelix, and finally, the event roles. I'm going to download this report as a Word document and generate a PowerPoint to present to the rest of my team. With minimal effort, I've been able to find out key information about my area of interest in a timely manner. I've found weapons, personnel involved, and other locations that may become important to my investigation and situational awareness. With the challenges of data volume only increasing, Globaleye is the powerful solution. For more information, please visit our website, syntelix.com.